Hello, welcome back. This is Kenshin1913, and we're let's playing Dragon Quest VIII. In the last episode, Jessica told her mother to f off, and basically she was going off to Port Prospect, in which we will be going to as well. But first, let's check the beach some more and run around. Do 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 do. Uh, da, 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 da. Sweet as seed of strength. Da, 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 da. Who needs it more? Kenshin. Ba, da, 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 da. Come on, don't be. Oh, you're a dud too. Alright, enough of that. Anyways, here's the other infamous monster the Family Doctor. Now, this guy isn't too difficult, but I forgot to heal before I came into battle. And look at that, nice damage right there. And I also, let's show off, you know what? Let's show off Dragon Slash, and let's show off Hatchet Man. Dragon Slash! Aww! Hatchet Man! Aww! What the hell, Family Doctor? You're not supposed to be doing that. Let's use an ability called Heal. And let's use Helm Splitter. Helm Splitter! Oh, come on! That's three freaking dodges in a row, man. What well, now? You're mocking me by by mimicking me when I'm just doing what a jerk. Head and dumb splitter, yay! It worked. And the defense minus 16, very nice. Die, family doctor, die. <laughs> and we get ourselves another copper monster coin. So look at that. We got $400 in the bank or gold, whatever. So that's basically all that's over here. Let's uh, continue to Port Prospect. Um, ba -da -na 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 -na. All right, enough of that. You're right. No one even knows what chariots and fire is. Let's keep going. Run, Kenshin. Run. Holy crap! New enemies: spiked hairs and hammer hoods. Now you see these spiked hairs here, and their uh, weaker cousin, Bunny Core, uh, Bunny Corn which we met up near Fairberry, we can actually dig, there's a rare drop that I might want to get and uh, by fighting these guys, these guys, and skippers as well. The rare drop, which is a, an accessory called the bunny tail. If you get that, it'll be very useful in the upcoming future, if you know what I mean. You know, with uh, stuff. With uh, whatever. I don't want to ruin everything. Especially for a lot of people I've noticed haven't played this game, so I don't want to spoil much. But yeah, if you do get a bunny tail, keep it for uh, a certain uh, lady that we're going to be meeting later. If that's, uh, if that's not a hint, I don't know what is. So yeah, I mean, we could be meeting more than one lady than just Jessica. Alright, there could be plenty of ladies at Port Prospect which we'll meet and give a bunny tail to. So yeah, let's just keep going, huh? Running. This is why I like this game, because it's an actual amount of time to get there. Holy crap, jail cats. These guys aren't too bad, but they will cast, uh... They will cast, uh... Um, what the hell is it called? Ice Bolt, or whatever they call it in this game. Fizz, or Frizz, or... Whatever. Crack, that's what it's called. Kenshin's on crack! Oh no! Take that, don't... Don't give Kenshin the crack. He doesn't want to be a drug dealer. Or a drug addict. Come on, jail cat. And they're called jail cats because they got stripes. Yet they don't really look like cats. Oh, Those cats are giving Kenshin the crack. Take that. There you go. Yangus says no to drugs. Oh, yeah. So let's continue on our way to Port Prospect. First, let's heal a bit. Jeez. Kenshin is whacked out on that crack. And look over there. Ooh. Is that an infamous monster over there? Let's go check. Yay, run, Kenshin. Run! With your... what? I don't even... What, are they, what would they call this yellow thing he's wearing? Like a coat? But they cut out the sleeves. And there's nothing else over here. So let's continue. I, well, that broken uh, palm tree looked like it was a uh, looked like it was a um, broken or 
a monster or something. It looked unusual, alright, people, and I got. And when I see something unusual, I gotta go investigate. Running up. Look at that beautiful view, huh? Jeez, don't you guys just want to take a vacation in the world of Dragon Quest IX? I mean, eight. Well, Dragon Quest IX wasn't too bad either. Too much stuff lying all over the ground for my taste, actually. In Dragon Quest IX. Lots of items and, al and uh, alchemy gear. Just a lot of stuff all over the ground. Like cow poop and horse poop. And then you pick it up with your hands. What kind of stuff? It's dirty. Alright, we gotta go around this little ridge over here. And we'll find ourselves this treasure. Yes. Who doesn't like a little bit of treasure? I do. Now, actually, there's gonna be an easier way to, uh, travel on the world map eventually. And then I'll probably start collecting treasures like crazy, but if they're on the way, I'll collect them. And we get ourselves a seed of life, which I'm gonna w hold off to use for the time being. So let's continue on. Yo, I just got into a battle. Holy crap. Let's go, hurry, Kenshin, you can make it. More butterflies. And look at that, we've made it to Port Prospect. Alright, sweet! Now, Port Prospect's a pretty nice place because we get some new equipment and different various people, which is cool. I like that. I like that a lot. And there's a dog, of course. Although, I'd figured there'd be more cats. Uh, let's see how many treasures are here. Because it's a fishing town or something. 14 treasures! Holy crap, Yangus! There's a lot of treasures. There we go. Thirteen treasures. Twelve treasures. Eleven treasures. Yay! More good items which I won't be using. Oh, come on, game! I was so close to the shops! Oh well, we'll have to wait until later. Damn it. So close, yet so far away. Hello! I'm just gonna smash the barrels behind you. Ten treasures left. Aww. Alright, now this lady, she's kind of important. Basically, you know how in the last game, Dharma Shrine had a thing that could show you... Could show you your job classes and your... How many more fights to get job classes? Well, this place is just like that, but with skill points. Basically, she'll tell you what kind of abilities you can learn with various... With various ability... With various, uh categories for your characters and also she can um, show you how many more points you need to get to the next uh, level I guess so yeah if you need to look into that um, go right ahead but I'm not going to bother because I have myself I know I know stuff so um, I won't be needing it also what else uh, yeah so if you need anything hell you can just you, Ask me whatever, or I'll let you know like what abilities are learned whenever. Hey, it's an, a man of war. Why don't you go back to the sea? Yes. Okay, I guess this information. I guess this information might be useful sometime down the road. I'm not sure. Anyways, let's get the frig out of here. Enough talking with monsters down in wells. Let's explore the town a little more. Port Prospect. The Port of Prospects. Welcome to Port Prospect. Oh, she's selling herbs. Now this lady, she's got a pretty interesting um, gimmick she's got over there. Uh, but we'll check into it more later. Oh, man. Alright, let's go into this lighthouse-like thing here. Building. Anyways, um, yeah, again, this area was very dark when I was playing it on my, on my TV, recording it for this Let's Play, but now it looks pretty damn good, and that's pretty nice. So nothing in here, so let's get the frig out of here. I don't want to save my game just yet. This priest sucks. So let's check around town some more. 
maybe find some more clues to what the hell is going on here. Where's Jessica? Yada yada yada. So yeah, okay, there's uh, that thing. You know what, let's go in the inn. See if there's anyone in the inn. Anyone interesting to talk to? I like how they gave the merchant a green jacket instead of an orange jacket. Or a purple jacket, they give it, make people look different. Ooh, a, sh a ship out in the middle of the sea. Hmm, that is interesting. Remember that for later. Sure, we can do that. All this information we'll be needing. A man walking across the sea. Wait, what would, what do you see, Jesus? Because I'm pretty sure Jesus is uh, the only guy who can do that. Walk on water and all that. And look at that. Uh, I think that's nine treasures down. So let's, uh, let's go down to the actual port. No, not that way. Okay, here we go. Let's go over here. Talk to this guy. And this guy is a scholarly looking fellow. Hey, man. What? A man walking across the sea? And then a huge monster surfaced? What the freak? Holy crap. That sounds dangerous. So yeah, let's uh, look around these uh, <clears throat> piers and then we'll go inside that huge building right there. Now we don't want to hang out here too too much because there might be a Jaws like thing. You know how Jaws came up on the pier and killed everyone. Funny little metals, huh? Your old flame from across the sea. I wonder. Hmm. Anyways, let's just keep exploring. A lot of information we're learning in this town. How about that? We're learning a boatload. No pun intended. Well, I guess pun intended. What the hell? Why not? Let's see if there's anything over on this pier. Nothing. And no one. Dead end. Ba ba ba. Look at that. That 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 ship's got a like a like a wheel on it or something. Looks pretty damn cool. That's all I know. So let's go into. I, I'm assuming this is where we can catch a ship to go to. Well, we'll have to find Jessica. Yeah. Oh, so you're looking to go to the Abbey? Where where is there an Abbey? And Paraguayan Quay. Oh, Malay Abbey. Let's go upstairs. Well, oh, there's a guy right there. Yes, I know. Someone was back there. We'll go back there later. Oh, and there are no fairies running now because there's a monster attacking? I wonder why. Look at this. This is great. Look at these dancers. They're just twirling. Look at these twirlers. I love it. And even the bartender's twirling. How cool is that? That's cool. Hey there. Oh yeah, she is a... She is one mighty fine looking lady. Ooh. Look at this. New places they're all talking about. Uh-huh. Oh, so this place was built by the Alexandra fa or Albert family. So Jessica, I guess, owns this whole deal. I guess. So that's pretty sweet. Let's check out what's out here. Is there anything? Hey, man. Yeah, those ships are pretty cool. Look at that. Look at that sweet ship right there. That is a cool ship. <clears throat> so, yeah. Aunt Yang, you got anything to say? Ah, oh, you know your thing, huh? Anyways, we'll have to go talk to Jessica in the next episode. See ya. Bye-bye.